Welcome, my name is Philip Ely, and on behalf of the Children, Youth, and Families at Risk Professional Development and Technical Assistance Center, I would like to thank you all for joining today's webinar. We are pleased to have Jack Alato as our presenter today, but before we begin, there are a few administrative announcements. A recording of today's webinar will be posted on the CIFAR PDTA Center's website at CIFAR.org. During the presentation, uh, we ask that you participate and join into the chat box and say uh, anything at any point. However, if you have specific, specific questions for our presenter, we ask that you place those in the Q&A box as depicted on the screen. During the pre or after the conclusion of today's webinar, a pop-up window will open asking you to participate in a short survey. Please click to continue to complete our brief online survey and share feedback on today's presentation, as well as any suggestions for future webinar topics. And now, without further ado, it's my pleasure to turn it over to Jack Alato, who is a certified fundraising executive and cost selling trainer with the Fundraising Academy. So Jack, the floor is all yours. Well, well um, thank you. Um, for inviting me to come today. I'm very honored to be here. And we're gonna be talking about one of my favorite topics, which is cause selling. And I'm gonna invite you to come back and sign up for our cause selling accelerate, which will begin in the fall. So as uh, Philip mentioned, I am Jack Alato and I am a certified fundraising executive. I have a master's degree from the State University of New York. And I'm very happy to be here, as I also said. So let me just tell you a little bit about our mission at uh, National University's Fundraising Academy. We aim to help nonprofits like the organizations you work for increase your fundraising capacities and impact in your communities and by extension, the entire society. When you raise more money for your causes, all boats come up, all things that are in your community that need to benefit by those nonprofits are raised. So that's really important. We, we go through and we present a contemporary curriculum presented by world-class nonprofit leaders and best in class faculty and renowned philanthropists. Now, when I say cause selling, some people are typically put off by that. But we also, every single day, we are in the business of selling. We sell ourselves, we sell our ideas, we sell the things that we want, we sell our desire for cooperation and companionship, and we pretty much try to engage in anything that enables us to sell, and even the most casual conversations we engage in are about selling. So there are three fundamental truths of selling. And the first is, if you don't know your cause, then you are not gonna be able to sell it and people will resent your efforts to sell it. So the first thing we emphasize in all of the work we do at, in, um, at the Fundraising Academy is to know your cause. The second thing, which we think is another important truth of selling, is that if you don't believe in what you are selling, no amount of a great personality or a technique will cover that. So the second thing that we really emphasize is to believe in what you are selling, believe in your cause. And the third important thing is if you can't sell with enthusiasm, the absence of it will be infectious. So we act, these are the three truths that we emphasize in cause selling. So what is cause selling? And how can we be good at it? Cause selling is the process of seeking out potential donors who have a need an interest and a passion in the cause that you are engaged in. And secondly, we assist them to recognize and define that need, that need that they have in themselves. 
then we show them how our cause can help fulfill that needs, need. And then finally, we inspire them to make a donation to our cause. So for example, if I'm working in ending homelessness, if I want to end homelessness in my city, I seek out potential donors who have a need to end homelessness, who have an interest in ending homelessness, and who have a passion and care for those who are homeless. Then I assist them to recognize and define that need. And sometimes we can't, our prospective donors and our prospects can't really define. We help and assist them in recognizing that. And then we help them and we show them how our cause, our organization to end homelessness helps fulfill those needs, those interests, and those passions. And then finally, once we've gone through these three other steps, we inspire them to make a gift to our organization. Our goal at the Fundraising Academy is to help all of you become a future-focused fundraiser. What do we mean by that? We mean that we want to help you become a fundraiser 